G'day guys, welcome to Lumber for a 1v1 Valkyrie tournament game. We're going to jump into match 1 and the round one back of stages for probably the most anticipated match in terms of skill levels. We've got 5 tier Tedessa, probably the favourite as Germany. He's going a regular squad with a few singles. Going down to the centre, Hansi on the other end as China. Assault squad going to the western, full weight. Then on the right, a mixture of singles, rifles and SMGs. Can't make up his mind. A bit of long range and close. And looks like they're going to encounter each other towards yeah, the center out. of mid. Tedessa going to cap from the house. Hansi's probably going to build his sandbags. Not going to go contend the center. So he will get that west though. But let's see, this is the contended flag it seems. A few of the singles have branched out to the eastern. Handy mostly rifles though, encountering Tedessa's mostly SMGs and look, doesn't bode well for Handy at the moment. Grenades are coming, Tedessa opting for the 80 grenade instead of explosion. Ooh, oh, but the rifles are doing well. Random number generator going to favour of Handy, one-shotting. Tedessa now moving his squad leader in. So, it's uh, grenading so far doesn't seem to be going in favour of anyone, but it should be going to the favour of Tedessa, as this is his home ground advantage, and it's a considerable advantage with the hosts, as Handy's from Australia, and he's from Russia, so it's going to be a 400 MS advantage. Though this will be Handy's choice of map and nation, and there'll be a swap, so it's going to be the first to win two, next game swap, and whoever wins two in a row will win the series for the most uh, fair, I guess, fair type of outcome, MG42 behind this stonewall rubble. Second buy of the Volstrom, very fashionable. On the other end, handy second buy of an assault squad, which is probably China fashion, as it's considerably cheap. 85 MP compared to the 110 of Germany, but they don't have a great assault squad leader gun. As the power is pushing the Volstrom out of there. Oh, one guy over here. Assault squad stuffing this Volstrom in his tracks. Oh, grenade. Volstrom does dispatching. See a salt squad in the background from Tedessa now going to the right. On the east, Handy coming in with some conscript peasants. A bit of a task. Oh, only Volstrom are holding, so perhaps they can make it. Mandisi, oh. <laughs> a bit short there, another one. Oh, that's, that's going to hit its mark. It's done very well, and he may even get that though. The SMG, oh, the kettle bomb misses. Looks like the Dessa may hold on to that flag. Uh, center is now Hansi's though. Six to one in the lead. Doing quite well at this stage. So it's going now from Tedessa. Now should hold the Eastern. So no three caps for everyone. So it's going to be a bit stable. No flags going to anyone dramatically. AT rifle from Tedessa already. Without any buy from Hansi. So looking... Looking probably to fight out the Panzer. Oh, with his AT. Probably was looking to fight the Panzer I. So ZSI 3 Willy's AT combo, interesting buy. Sniper out from Tedessa as well. Now we'll turn the tide in the center. And try to pick up the troops in the center flag. Hansi holding the west very frontally, which is pretty cool to see. With his AT now come charging, perhaps going to go for the sniper. This is going to be key if he knows it's there. He doesn't, perhaps he's not going towards it. Oh, he's going to go for it. Oh, sniper. He's going to see it. He's seeing it. And he's going for it. Oh, oh takes him out. <laughs> That's key. He's got it. This was AT such a troll unit, to be honest. It's so damn good at this stage of the game and some maps, especially. AT rifle guy. Doesn't want to shoot his AT rifle and he's shooting his SMG, but oh, it's giving it away because it doesn't have armor at the back. He sh shot the guy out of the car, and now this vehicle is oh, taken out <laughs> by the SI3 before it can be captured. A sentinel now to Dessa, working his way in with a grenade. Takes it quite a few, but loses his life. An interesting escalation of a paratrooper squad quite early in the game. So SI3. A pretty damn good infantry support gun, so if it were a bit closer, it could potentially HE shell these paratroopers back to hell. For to hell. ZPU4. Infantry killer. Not a bad one. 
No, not as good as a 20 mil. And its gun gets damaged very easily. Power Trooper. Bit of sandbag cover for the machine gun. Another sniper. Oh, this sniper is actually from... This is just a regular squad sniper. Doesn't have the aim shot ability. Looks like it can spot though. It's spotting. Another Willis AD by Hansi. Coming in to take out the paras on the, on the center flag. 24-2-1. Oh, misses horribly. This SMG is oh, such a silly one. Unfortunately, not able to get any shots off. Ooh, this chicken may be collateral damage. Oh, he runs away, gets oh, chicken is died. But nice shot there from that AT rifle. So AT, AT uh, Jeep. Kinds of grenadiers as well. Wow, a lot of elite tier from Tedessa really escalating it versus China. But uh, going to be trouble when once the ZPU gets up in in placement range. At least to get down quickly. It may even get oh maybe a victim to this quickly. Oh, lucky knocks out the Panzer Grenadier. Doing some hmm. struggling to get good damage off to the troops in the far range. Oh, we got the guerrillas out. Numbers on the center. ZPU doing okay. Takes that machine gun, AT rifle. Puma, what the hell was this is Tedessa doing? This is set aside three is gonna lay in wait, plus the ZPU can take out even the Puma. Oh, take shoot the Puma ZPU. Oh no, what a shot by the Puma. Set aside three misses. Oh no, oh what the Puma got away with it. That's interesting. What the hell? This Puma's taking hits like anything. Oh what the hell? I had no idea. Okay. That is a very smart buy if Tedessa knew exactly, calculated the exact armor and penetration of ZP, ZPU and the ZSI-3. I knew this was the best uh, buy for the situation. Interesting. Very interesting buy indeed. MGs from the Paras, putting down Hansi squad in the center. Puma. Not doing too much yet. Brandenburg is also coming in from Tedessa. Panzer I from Hansi going to the right. They try to force a three cap, though. Should be dispatched quite easily once uh, with the Brandenburgers and the Puma being able to go to the right flag so quickly. As if so three, still quite far away to really take much shots off. It's got quite a low range. They sent us slowly to this uh, top left, this superior five out <laughs> MG43, MG34s. Just devastating the weak. Chinese troops in the center, unable to <laughs> give much firepower back. This top left, oh, last like 30 kills have been all Germans. Or well, the German side, I mean. Dishing out the kills. Puma. Panzer Why taken out. Still again. The firepower in the center proving too much. Now yeah, going to Tedessa. Panzer I put away. So that's three size so three coming closer, but is in danger now. There's nothing to guard it but this one little rifleman forced to get out the gun and SMG stops it just in time. Now going back in perhaps. No, this guy's going to the left and this now will leave this set aside three as a sitting duck. A19. AT gun. No, not much infantry to guard it once again. 
Another sandbag from Tedessa. Look at the machine guns. <laughs> Anyone coming to the center? <laughs> Torn up. They can come in, cap the flag for a bit, but they're all gonna get shot up by the machine gun fire. Look at how many machine guns are here. So, <laughs> machine gun center. Brandenburg is in great position. So many AT weaponry here. Wonder if uh, to this will buy Panzer N. Puma still <laughs> alive. Panzer just not doesn't have much infantry going on. What's going on here? Not too sure. This area looks very impregnable. Oh. And this one Brandenburg just comes through and <laughs> destroys this SSI-3. And it's going to come to the A-19. Hansi's just... Oh no, he just left all this area open. Nothing to stop. Oh, he's going to just go in there, get the dynamite from inside. And is that the dynamite? No, it's just an AP grenade. It doesn't have a dynamite. Oh, he can't damage it. it looks like Hansi may be in luck. The peasants are coming in. So finally dispatch it and looks like the A19 is safe for now. Puma probably could have come up now for a cheeky cheeky shot. Uh, there's a Willis AT there to protect it from a grab. Grab and go. A19 still there, ready to fire. Interesting, it's got uh, these two Mm, two pipes at the top, one four. SU twelve, SBG, interesting. Not many not much infantry though. Where's Hansi's infantry? It just doesn't have any weight. Like again, another like a small soul score could just come charging out of the seal and putting an end to all this instantly with just these para, um, these conscripts guarding. Another peasant squad. SU twelve behind the hill. I'm not sure what it's going to do, perhaps it's going to take out the MGs bit by bit, but it's going to take a long time. SC-12 also not known to be that accurate. Let's see what he's targeting. Yep, most likely those MGs. Still nothing yet. Takes the sandbag out. MG now running to a different position. Oh, nice shot though, that one. Perhaps uh, yep, this uh, this will work. Maybe a few more uh, mostly play shells. It is doing okay indeed. <laughs> to Dessa, microing his way in the center. Grenade after grenade. SU-12. Puma may come up to play though, look at the go. Ooh, it's covered by the stone wall though. Will the Puma even just run charge and charge it? AT rifle here though from Hansi. So this is Puma not going to play. It's doing okay I, I dare say this SU-12. Oh, Panzerfaust and the Brandenburger uh, hits but doesn't penetrate. I think it's like a truck, it doesn't actually kill the truck, unless it hits the engine. Here comes the Puma, evades the shot, but here's the AT rifle from that, so you can get a nice side shot from the Puma. Oh, it's vaulting, the lag is real. Oh, lucky. Unfortunately for Handy there, probably had a bit of lag. Well, a frontal shot will be too much to ask, I think. 28 to 29. Tedesa now takes the lead. MPY is considerably, considerably in, hand, in Tedesa's uh, favor. Double the score on kills. Though versus China, it's usually the case. Set up another Brandenburger squad, no, German youth squad. You see 12 still trying to take out the machine gunners. I think they've done a, good, it's done a decent job as the point seems relatively clear. 
allowing Hansi to get one guy in there. A bit of a nutritional warfare at the moment to this uh, hiding the machine gunners as he's trying to locate them. And the centre flag is decapped. No response yet from Tedessa, just buying more infantry to fill the gaps. And there's an officer from Tedessa, looking straight down here somewhere. Oh, I see 12 proving to be a great buy in my opinion. Oh, all right. I thought that MG would have been dead. Still so many MGs after one dies, another one gets replaced, it seems. MG after MG, one, two, three, four, five. <laughs> Full of MGs. The thing is, with versus China, they don't really have a great infantry killer. The ZPU is one. Probably the mortar is uh, the best energy you ever have. Could have been the one to buy it. That's why probably Tedesa is spamming these machine gunners to uh, fight China. Decent, uh, decent match versus the numbers. <laughs> it's that Panzer N that we were talking about before. Something Handy is ill prepared for. He's got the A19 and the SU-12 versus susceptible to HE shells. That's a fair, de fair way away. As uh, the Panzer N got to venture past his, the safety of his hill to really do damage to it, I think. But maybe not. Let's see what happens. Yeah, 150. Yeah, it's only, I can't get that close. Oh, eight. What's this guy doing though? It's coming closer. <laughs> a bit of Panzi. Oh, needs to go back. Going on, he's got a shot. Oh no, Hansi! Oh no, is it lag or what? Oh shit, it's taking out the crew and now to sitting back there. Oh, suicidal will is 18 now. Just no way. There's so many MGs, it's gonna get torn to shreds before it gets close. Oh wow, a nice shot there. Oh no, sorry, it's <laughs> behind you here. There's no way. Oh, <laughs> fans end clutch shot. Takes the Willys AT out. And now I can focus on the AT gun. The A... A19, was it? Yep, A19. AC12. They're still alive. And he now getting the tanker in. Lucky shot. Hansi. Still in the, the same position. <laughs> oh, knocks him out again and uh, he should put this away. <laughs> oh. <laughs> there you go. Now with some stormtroopers going the west, this is a decent push. The recallers as well you can potentially uh, push through, but uh, oh, probably not. <laughs> Random beggars, oh, Panzer N as well. They're not even going to get past the the hill. And once they get past the hill, they're going to go fight machine gun after machine gun, elite tier. Now this push is <laughs> definitely doomed for failure. At least he'll hold his flag. I sent out really unapproachable head on. It's just too many, too many Panzer Grenadiers. The mortar was probably needed instead, I think. And the AT gun is definitely something. Uh, I just don't know why it went down. Oh, it uh, did okay, I guess, for his host. 
But so this is host. It's very hard to win a game at 400 MS, most definitely. So 3728. It's going to have to do now. He's going to try to push on the right, going in the Salt Squad plus some conscripts. Puma now going to try hold. To the front they go. Officer being direct control there from Tedessa. Using the binoculars. Now coming in now. Not much holding, so it looks like he may get it. A decent choice here from Hansi. Hansi N is coming as well to support. Sandbagging a bit on the right as well. And he does cap the flag. It's a problem with the machine gunners is they're pretty high on CP. And that means you're quite sparse elsewhere. But here's a paratrooper squad attacking. They've got decent support. They should be able to push through. SU-12 from Handy not participating really. Recall this from Handy as well. But the superior firepower of these barrels. You know, Dispatch this assault squad quite easily. Leave the bazooka. Oh, ho, 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 ho. I see 12. Nice shot. Wow, that guy survived. This guy survived. Assault squad now coming in. This is meat, the meat grinder on Tedessa, 168 deaths, 3,100 to 1,200 score. And he has managed to get to center as well. Wow, interesting. 43 to 35. Tedessa has a lot of MP up his sleeve. He's decapped the center as well. Sniper out from Hansi. Oh, ho, ho, ho. and the N already spotted. Next shot, maybe. Oh, oh no! Sniper got got killed by the oh, by the end. That's oh, a girl sniper. Oh, interesting. It looks like a girl. Forty-three thirty-six. No, guys, a bit low energy today. I'll just let you watch the action. G42, MG42. <laughs> Not looking good now. Yeah, the right side's uh, held strong now. Two FG42s on both ends. It comes at end. Pure and support. Oh, Panzer is doing so well. Look at it. 1,376. Boom. Panzer now running in. <laughs> right click, right click. Not using any direct control because of the lag. But uh, now slaughtered to Tedessa, Tedessa's MGs. Not much coming as well. Maybe he's giving up. AI is controlling. He's given up. Okay. Good game from Tedessa. Plenty of key kills, but just a steady hand. Steady hand holding the points with superior firepower and just waiting for Hansi to uh, lunge himself at, the, at, at it suicidally. Good game. Maybe next game will be better for Hansi on his host.